and Terry Hollins arrives at the Fingal Fingers in fourth place overall. Massive yet quick and explosive. Terry should do well here. And his opponent in this heat is Phil Fister. As we mentioned earlier, Phil used this event to vault himself back in contention with Marius Pujanowski a year ago. That's right. Phil is probably the world's best in the Fingal Fingers and took advantage of Marius' relative weakness to produce a five-point swing in the standings. And obviously, Phil is hoping the same scenario plays out here today. The time to beat, 30.92 seconds, put up by Poland's Sebastian Venta. Phil's off to a good pace, Kaz. Up with two or three hand grips, double push, a lot of power. Now on to the fourth finger. That one weighs 605 pounds. Big lead here, great pace. Should be a fast time. But will it be enough? Terry Holland's trying to track down Phil Fister as he comes close to the clock. He will not get the win, but his time is strong, 31.78. But Phil Fister has left some points on the board. Meanwhile, Terry Holland stops the clock at 40.36 seconds. Both men looking for confirmation on their time. Fister, five fingers, 31.78. That puts him currently into second place. Terry Holland's five fingers, 40.36 seconds. He slides currently into fifth. Phil Fister had tremendous focus prior to this start. Knowing he needed to do something special, Phil stepped up and delivered a great time. But will it be enough to beat Marius?